And good evening, everybody. Hello, how are you? Good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good evening. Good evening. I'm sorry for the little delay. It was, I think it's the weather that is affecting the connection. But okay. we are here. Let's see, let's see. There's a... We have, let me see, a lot of people here. So let's see, Ana Maria, Ana Maria, you left my class yesterday early. Hello, Ana Maria. Hello, teacher. Yes, I know, but my my, my child, wake up. I know. I, I, I had to go to. I know, I know, I understand. You can say my kids. You can say my, my kids. kids also. Okay. Yes. So tell me, Ana Maria, how was your day? Good, busy. Busy? Okay. I like it. She says, good, busy. What did you do today? I'm worked. Are you working from home or do you have to go to the office? No, from home. Okay, so tell me, is it easier or more difficult for you working at home? Oh. Uh, it's more difficult because uh, my my kids uh, always uh, said, "Mama, mama, mama, play with me or mamita." Okay. <laughs> yeah, like that. Okay. Yes, you like that. It, <laughs> you can say it like this. You can say that they are all over me. If you say they are all over me, that means that your kids are all the time like asking you, calling for you. Okay. Okay. Well, thank you, Ana Maria. Mr. Edwin Cruz, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Hi, everybody. How was your day, Edwin? Um, very nice because I, I the work is very easy today. I designed okay. many arts. No, no, it's problem. Okay, the work was was past, past yes okay was okay. very easy well thank you easy, thank you yes. edwin mr Cotto, good evening how are you mr luis Cotto. oh excuse me oh i'm sorry oh bye no thank problem, you no problem tell me how was your day Today the working is too many busy. Oh really? It's hard. Oh yes. Okay. Yeah. What time? What time did you? What time do you usually finish working? My working is today the, the five o'clock. At five o'clock. Okay. So and um, do you travel a long way? Not much. How, is how long does it take you? Long. 10 minutes, one hour, how long? My traveling to working is 20, 20 minutes. Okay, so you can say it like this. Look in the chat. You can say, it takes me. It takes me, and then you say the time. It takes me like 10 minutes. It takes me 20 minutes. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. Thank you, Louis. Okay. Let's see. You. Let's see. I have a lot of people here. Mr. Beaches. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello. How are you? How are you in this lovely? I'm fine. Night? Thanks. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Well. <laughs> yes. Tell me. Tell me. Okay. Okay. Yes. I'm. Today? I'm good. I'm fine, fine. Okay. Great. And what about you? <laughs> well, just fine here, the same as always. Working, working, working. A lot of activities. Working. <laughs> and okay, me too. Only working from my house. Oh, you're working from home? Yes, yes. Okay, tell me, what I'm do you do? I'm a teacher. What is you're a teacher. Oh, really? What's your subject? Yeah. Yeah. 
Um, what is your subject? Ah, okay. Uh, social study, studies. Social studies. Excellent. And can I ask you, where do you work? <laughs> uh, I work uh, near here in Cologne. Oh, really? That's nice. Excellent. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see who else. I'm sorry, I cannot be asking everybody because we are a big group. So let's see, Urania, good evening. Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening, everyone. Oh my gosh, is it raining there? Yes, it's raining. I can hear it. It's very strong. <laughs> So yes. tell me, Urania, what did you do today? Uh, I, I do, uh, I, I do deal. laundry. I, I deal, deal the laundry. I do the laundry, the laundry, okay, uh, all perfect. day long, all day long. <laughs> oh my gosh, it was a big yeah. bunch of clothes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Urania. Let's see, let's see, let's see who else is here around. Let's see. Uh, Betsaida, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Okay, Betsaida, if I'm not mistaken, you are from Usulutan. Yes. Okay, I have a question for you. Tell me, what is the weather like? there now in this moment what is the weather like weather um, clima clima uh, is is a cold is cold yes <laughs> hot or cold 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 hot in usulotan wow <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Well, thank you, Betsaida. So let's see. Okay. Today, guys, we are going to work with, um, again, we are going to work with WH questions. But yesterday, we were working with WH questions with the verb be. And today, we are going to use the WH questions, but we are going to be working with the other verbs. Remember, the verb be is a special verb, so it has its own rules but the rest of the verb, they have different rules. And that's something that we are going to be dealing with today. So let's start. I imagine that you are working on the platform, right? Are you working in the platform, guys? Yes, yes. teacher. Yes. Okay, excellent, excellent. Today yes, I'm going teacher. to show you, today I'm going to show you one of the videos from the platform and we are going to work with that because we are going to practice pronunciation first. The first activity is listening and then we are going to practice pronunciation, okay? So, you ready? Okay, teacher. Let we me are ready. with you, okay? Okay, let me close this in Can you here. Take note? And I'm going to share with you exactly this. And like this, okay. but we need it at uh, the second 14 seconds. Hi, a new day. Into a conversation about jobs, you question words as well as a statement. Where do you work? Where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student, and I have a part-time job, too. Oh? Where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Where do you work, okay. Andrea? I work at Thomas... Where do you work? Okay, guys. Before we listen to it again, is there any question about the vocabulary? Do you have any question about the vocabulary, guys? Mm 
No question? No teacher. Okay, perfect, perfect. Let's see. We are going to listen to it again because then we are going to practice it, okay? Let's listen to it. Work, Andrea. I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student, and I have a part-time job, too. Oh? Where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Okay, let's see, let's see. Remember, let's check it out. Uh, really, what do you do there? I'm a guy. Remember, we have the question here. What do you do there? If you look, this question is using the auxiliary do. What do you do there? Okay. As the question is a WH question, Andrea answers with the information. She says, I am a guy. I take people on tours to countries in South America like Peru. Okay. Let's see what else. Part-time job. Remember, a part-time job is when you work just part of the day, not the whole day. And heaven. Oh, this is very interesting. When we talk about heaven, remember, uh, in Spanish, we use just one word. We use, uh, let's see. We use heaven. In Spanish, it means cielo. And we use sky, which in Spanish also means cielo. What's the difference? The difference is very simple. Heaven is the spiritual one, okay? God, Dios, is in heaven, okay? Plane, airplane, fly in the sky. The sky is the one that we can see, okay? That's the only difference. Remember, it's in Spanish that we use just one word for two different things, okay? But in English, we are more specific. We use heaven for the spiritual one, and we use sky for the physical, the one that we can check out. Any question up to here? No? Okay, perfect, let's see. Right now, I'm going to divide you in pairs. We are going to go to the breakout rooms. You are going to have two minutes to practice the conversation. Practice both persons, okay? Switch roles, because when we come back here, I'm going to choose six persons, six different persons to Develop it here for everybody, okay? So let's see. Uh, you have the conversation there on the WhatsApp group. I placed it, I placed it there already, okay? Ready, guys? Let's see. Perfect. So jump in, please. Are you having problems with the connection, Wendy? Let's see, I'm going to get you. Here. Yes, teacher, I have a trouble. Wendy, I sent you an invitation for you to join a group. Okay, teacher, thank you. Let's see. Mr. Edwin, you couldn't connect? Yes, but there isn't nobody. Only, only me. Let me check, let me check. Let's see, Marilyn hasn't gone, so I'm going to get you, Mr. Edwin Cruz. The, yes, there's Wendy waiting for you. I just sent Wendy. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm going to, don't, Edwin, listen to me. 
Don't move right now. I'm going to move you to different places so you can go back to work with Wendy, okay? Let's see. Uh, where did I send you now? Okay, with uh, one, two, three. Perfect. Now jump in. What happened? <laughs> Sorry, <please. laughs> I, I pushed I push the button. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Sorry. We'll do it again. Sorry. We'll do it again. We'll okay. do it again. Do you have the invitation now? Yes. Please jump in. I am a student and I have a part-time job too. Oh, really? Oh, wh where do you work? In a fat food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. That's great. Right. Remember to switch, okay? I'm a, I'm a guy. I take people on tours to country in South America, like Peru. Wow, interesting. ¿Cómo se pronuncia esa teacher? Interesting. Interesting, okay. Yeah, it's a great job. I really love it. And what do you do? Okay, let's see, let's see who's going to start. Let's see who can start right now, please. Um, let's do it this way. Hold on a second, guys. Okay, we're going to do it like this. It's better. Okay, let's see. Betsaida and Jamie Campos, please. Okay. Hello. Betsaida is Jason and Jamie is Andrea. Okay. okay. Um, where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time part job too. Oh, where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger heaven, heaven? Oh. I don't know perfect. how to perfect. say this word. Oh. It was <laughs> Thank you very much. Now, Ana Maria and Aura, chicas, please. Me? Yes, Ana Maria, you start, and Aura. Ana Maria is Jason, and Aura is Andrea. Okay. Okay. Where do you work, Andrea? I work. I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? Uh, I'm I'm a guide. I take people in tours to to countries in South. South in America. South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. 
And uh, what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time job too. Oh, where? I guess no middle. Where do you where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Him. Okay. Perfect. Thank you very much, ladies. Mr. Carlos Zelaya, please, with Carol Rivera. Okay. Okay, where did Carlos went? Carlos, hello. Okay, perhaps he's having problems with the connection. Who can help us? Oh, Where the, do you work, the... Andrea? Okay, I work at Thomas Good Travel. Oh, really? What do you do? What do you do there? I am guide to uh, take people on tour to countries in South America, like Peru. Oh, very simple. Yes. It's a great job. I love it. And um, what do you do? I am student and I have a part-time job too. Oh, where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Okay. Okay, perfect. Just remember, restaurant, restaurant, and Hamburger Heaven. Heaven. Okay. In this case here, South, South America. Okay, okay teacher. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Well done. Well done. Now, Mr. Freddy and Sarah, please. Okay. What do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guy. I take people on tours to country in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's great job. I love it. And um, what do you do? I'm a student, and I have a part-time job, too. Oh, where do you work? In a fast, fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Well done. Now, please, Mr. Noel Ramirez and Norma de Leon. Okay. Hello. Norma, can you hear us? Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you, Noel. We are waiting yes, for Norma. Yes, I'm ready. Okay, Noel, please start. Where do, where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do, dear? I am a guy at take people on tours to country in South America, like Peru. How is telling things? Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time job too. Oh, where do you work? In a fast, a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Thanks. Okay, perfect. Well done, well done. Let's see the last one because of the time. Let's see who can help us. Um, Urania, please. And Mr. Beaches. Okay, I'm ready. <clears throat> okay. Where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? 
I am a, I am a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student. And I have a part-time job too. Oh, where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Okay, well, 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 perfect. Now let's see. Listen please again. Where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Or oh, really, what do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time job too. Oh, where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Now, let's see. Okay, guys. This conversation is for us to get introduced to the WH questions with the verbs. I told you. Now, we are going to see a small, let's see, we are going to watch first small presentation that I prepared for you. So we can analyze a little bit of this. Let's see. Okay, the WH questions. Do you remember from yesterday? The WH questions are used to ask for specific information and they can, they cannot be answered with a yes or no. You need to give specific information, okay? What? If you remember, we use what to ask about things. Like, what do you need? We are asking for information about something. I need a suit, you see? Next one, what does his sister like? Uh, we are asking about what does the lady, the girl like? We are asking for the information. Look, she likes the red dress. Look at this one, what color? Still, we are asking for information. We are asking about something. What color do you want? Blue, very simple. Look, what color does Claire like? Yellow. Now, here, we can be more specific if we say, what color do you want? I like blue. What color does Claire like? She likes yellow. Like this, look, pay attention please. Uh, let's see, let's see, I remember that I saw Mr. Christian, Christian Calderon. Hello. Hello, teacher. Tell me, what color do you like? I like blue color. Okay, perfect. I like the color blue. Okay. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Mr. Carlos Zelaya. What color does Christian like? Christian likes the blue color. Okay, the color blue. Remember, color blue. thank you very much, mister. Remember, in this case, there's something that we must be careful with. In the question, what color does Christian like? The answer, Christian likes the color blue. If you notice in the question, as we have the auxiliary, the verb goes in the base form. In the answer, because we are talking about he, she, or it, we add an S to the verb. We're going to get to it later on. Don't worry. Let's continue with the presentation. 
Okay, what size? What size do they need? Oh, extra large. What size does Peter want? Let's see, Peter wants small. Wish. Remember, guys, we use wish to ask about a choice. We have options when we use this question. Why, which coat do you need? The brown one, you see? Which pants does he want? The gray one. When we use which, remember we have options and we can see the options. We use one when the option is singular and we use one when the option is plural. And remember, those options we can see, okay? In English, pants, pants is plural. Even though it's just one for us, in English, it is plural. In English, the palabra pantalón, would be like something like pantalones. That's why it's plural in English, okay? Even though we are talking just about one, okay? So let's continue. Any question up to here? Please tell me. Questions? No? We cool? Okay, excellent. Let's continue. Why? Okay, okay. Look, we use why to ask about reasons. Okay? We answer these questions with because. This is very, very important. Always when we have the question why, we answer with because. That's mandatory. Why do you like this sweater? Because it is new. Why does your friend like those sneakers? Because they are cheap. Okay, very, very simple. Remember the structure, okay? To form WH questions, use the WH word plus do or does plus the subject plus the base form, okay? Remember. The WH word, do or does, subject in the base form. What do you like? WH, do, subject, base form. Remember, what is our guide in choosing do or does? The subject. Which sweater does she need? As the subject here is she, the auxiliary is does. Which sweater does she need? Remember the use of do and does. Okay. What do? We use do with. I, you, we, and they. What do I need? What do you need? What do we need? What do they need? And does. Remember, we use does with. He, she, and it. What does he need? What does she need? What does it need? Okay, now let's practice. Look at this question. Where do you work? What do you do in your company? What time do you finish working? Look at those questions because those questions you are going to be asking each other in the breakout room right now. I already sent you the picture of the question, okay? So you are not wasting time with them. I'm sorry, I'll, just if somebody didn't understand me. Si no me entendieron, para que no perdamos tiempo, les mandé las preguntas al grupo de WhatsApp, okay? So you can check them there. So right now, I'm going to send you to the groups. Okay, let's see, let's see. And we are going to change all the sections. Let's see. Perfect. Please, get in. I'm going to pass by checking out that you are doing the exercise. Remember, you have to ask and answer both.
Ana Maria and Joel. Hello, teacher. Hello, Ana Maria. You couldn't get into the group? Sorry? You couldn't get into the group? No pude ingresar al grupo. No. Eh, I, I, in the group, I was only me. <laughs> okay, you were supposed to work with Joel. Okay. And let's see, I have a Suli is also alone, so we are going to move Suli. Okay. Mr. Joel Biches, can you hear me? Let's see, Ana Maria, I'm going to send you to another group, okay? Okay, teacher. And we have Mr. Luis Cotto. Let's see. Let's see. Mr. Luis, we are going to send you to another group, Mr. Luis. There you go. You already have an invitation to join a group. Tiene una invitación para unirse a un grupo. No teacher. Ana Maria. What happened? I sent you to group A. Let's see. I'm going to send you to another group again. But I don't see the invitation. Okay, don't worry. You can do it here with Irma. Irma is here. Okay. No battery. Please charge. I'm gonna be back in a second. Irma. Hello. Hello. I'm here. Okay. Okay, Ana Maria. What do you want? I want to practice it with Ana Maria. Yes. Okay, Ana Maria, where do you work? No battery, please charge. I work at Litzmar Americas. Okay. What do you do in your company? Uh, I'm a research and development specialist. Okay. What time do you finish working? Uh, I'm finished working at 6 p.m. Okay, thank you. And you, where do you work? I work at Dada Dada y Compañía. What do you do in your company? I am an uh, operation manager. Okay, uh, what time do you finish working? I finish working at uh, five o'clock. Okay, perfect. Well done, ladies. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, Sarah, who did you work with, Sarah? I work with uh, Noel. And Marilyn. Okay, please, Sarah, can you tell me about Noé? Yes, Noé, he is a taxi driver. Okay. And he's finished the working at, seven, at six o'clock or seven o'clock. And okay, yes, and yes. Okay, that's it. Thank you. Noel, okay. can you tell me about Sarah? Hello, Noel. I think the weather is affecting. What, Joel? Joel Trigueros or Joel Villet? Noé. Noel. Noel. Ah, oh, sorry, Noel. Hi, Sara. I'm sorry, Noel. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Sorry, teacher, I have some problem with the internet. No problem, I no can, problem, I understand. I can... 
Yeah. I imagine it's the weather. Don't worry, don't worry now. Let's see. Freddy. Hello, Freddy. Who are you working with, Freddy? With, I don't remember the name, but. Uh, Edwin oh, it Edwin. was Edwin. Edwin Cruz. Edwin. Yeah. Edwin. Okay, Edwin tell me about Edwin. Uh, Edwin works at Bocadelli. He is okay. a graphic designer and Perfect. he finishes working at 5 p.m. every single day. That's everything that, that I know about him. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Edwin, please tell me about Freddy. Okay. Freddy is really very busy every day because he's studying the University of El Salvador. Okay, perfect. What's his schedule? What time does he finish studying? Do you remember anything? Yes, he okay. studies law, laws. Laws? Law. 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 Yes. Law. Okay. okay, perfect. Thank you very much, Edwin. You're welcome. Urania, tell me, please, I want to know about Betsaida. Saida doesn't work. She's studying. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. What does she study? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> you didn't ask her? <laughs> oh, no. no. <laughs> okay. We will ask her later, later. Don't worry. Thank you, Rania. Mr. Joel okay. Trigueros. Hi. Tell me about Good evening, Suli, teacher. Yeah. Good evening. I want to know about Suli. Please tell me. With Suli? Yes. You were working with Suli. No. I work in Norma. Okay. Tell me about Norma. According to this, oh yes, Norma de Leon. Okay, tell me please, where does Norma work? Joel? Oi. I am asking you, where does Norma work? Uh, she answer is work in the home. Oh, she's her working home. at home. Her home. From her home. Her home. Yeah. Okay. So there's no schedule. And Norma, tell me, what about Joel? Where does Joel work? Joel, he is working in the company, cell phone company. Okay, which company? Tell me, tell me. I have problems with... I, the company. I, don't, I don't remember the company. Oh, the okay. company. Sorry, teacher. Yes, because I was going to complain. Okay, let's see, let's see. If you see, <laughs> it's very simple. It's like if I'm asking, like, let's see, Mr. Carlos Celaya. Hello, Carlos. Hello, teacher. Tell me. Hello. Tell me, Carlos, Hello, where do you work? In hospital. I work, in a hospital. I work in hospital. Say, okay, yes. what do you do there? It's assistant counter. Okay, what? Accountant? Counter. Accountant yes. assistant. Accountant assistant. Perfect. Yes, teacher. Thank you. And tell me, what is your schedule? What time do you finish working? Finish at 5 p.m. At 5 p.m.? 5, 5 p.m. Okay, okay, very interesting. Now let's see who am I missing? Quien me falta? Thank you, teacher. Teacher. Yes. teacher. I have a question. When you okay. answered when you answered uh, the question what uh, what time do you finish working? You answer I finish at five yes. or I finish exactly. at I it finish. Correct. Okay, repeat again, please, that I couldn't hear you quite right. What What is the the right answer? Okay, or, tell or me the, the answer. answer. 
I finish at 5 p.m. At 5 p.m. And the other, I finish at the no. 5 p.m. At. 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 Yes. Okay. The sentence is, I finish at. Look at the chat. I finish at. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's see, guys. Thank you. We, we still need to watch uh, another small video. AUX note. Let me share it with you right now because it's part of the activity. Okay, let's see. Oh my gosh, it's not this. Okay, it was this. We need to move here. Okay, simple present, WH questions and statements. This is actually what we are working with. Please pay attention. By the end of this lesson, participants will be able to understand and use simple present. Simple present WH questions and statements. What do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time job. Where do you work? I work at a restaurant. Where do you go to school? I go to the University of Texas. Where does Andrea work? She works at Thomas Cook Travel. What does she do? She's a guide. She takes people on tours. How does she like it? She loves it. Okay, guys. Before we continue, look at the question. What do you do? In this case, when they ask you the question, what do you do? They are asking you about what is your occupation, okay? In this case, it's what do you do? Oh, I'm a student and I have a part-time job. Where do you work? I work at a restaurant or I work in a restaurant. You see? Where? Where do you go to school? I go to the University of Texas. It's asking about the location. But look at this question. Where does Andrea work? She works at Thomas Cook Travel. Remember, when we have the subject she, we use the auxiliary does. Okay? If we have I, you, we, or they, the auxiliary is do. And if you look the verb, in this case, the base form, I work. But in here, as we are talking about her, we are saying she works. The meaning of the verb is the same, but in English, when we are talking in affirmative, simple present, and we are talking about he, she, or it, we add S or ES to the verb, okay? Let's continue. I, you. Work, take, study, teach, do, go, have. He, she, works, takes, studies, teaches, does, goes, has. Any question up to here? Not okay. teacher. No questions? Not teacher. Okay, okay, let's continue. Teacher, have a question. Yes, tell me, tell me. Um, uh, it, the form is used for the simple present only. Sure. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 oh. You mean this one? Yes. Okay. Uh, let's see, let's see. I want to go over this pretty fast. I'm sorry, I'm going to switch into Spanish just for 30 seconds. Voy a cambiar al español solo por 30 segundos. Tercera persona del singular presente simple forma afirmativa. Cuando hablamos del presente simple, hablamos de él, de ella o de un objeto En afirmativo le agregamos S o ES al verbo. ¿Ok? Does, goes, has, you see? Works, takes, studies, teaches, does. Solamente entonces, pero solo en afirmativa. 
In questions and in negatives, we have the auxiliary. En negativas y en preguntas tenemos el auxiliar. Si mira el auxiliar, la tomó ya sobre sí. Entonces el verbo en su forma base. ¿Ok? Ok, ok. Thank you, teacher. Is that clear, guys? No more questions? Okay, let's continue. Now that you have watched the video, I'm sure you noticed the changes on the verbs when talking in third person singular. For example, we say, I, you work, he, she works. I, you take, he, she takes. This inflection happens only in third person singular affirmative sentences. Also, take note that when we ask any type of questions in simple present, as in this case we're using WH question words, we must use the auxiliary do for I, you, we, they, and thus for he, she, it. When we put everything together, this is how the structure will look like. We have WH question word plus auxiliary plus the subject plus the verb in its base form plus complement, plus question mark. Remember, in this case, the verb no es. Why? Because the auxiliary takes it, okay? If we are talking about he, she, or it. Now, what I want you to do is to type in a WH simple present question in our discussion box. Okay, guys. By the end of this lesson, that's part of your homework. You need here in the discussion box, you need here to add a pause, okay? What are you going to do? Write a WH questions with the answer, please. Remember, you are just going to click here, then you are going to add a pause, okay? That's part of your homework, okay. Up to here, tell me, is there any question? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Bluetooth note. Yes. Yes, teacher, I have a question oh. for you. Tell me, tell me. Power off. And, and different pronunciation when you say plus. Is plus. She is, she say plus. Plus. Plus, plus. The thing is this, uh, her English is from Canada. Mm. Any other question? Okay. Okay, thanks. No, you're welcome. Any other question, guys? Yes, teacher. Tell me. Can you repeat, please, the word, word the homework? The homework. Okay, under the video, there's a discussion. You are going to add a post, a question, a WH question with your answer, please. Just that. Okay, okay, thanks. Okay, let's see, let's see. We are going to talk a little bit right now. We are going to have a small conversation. Let's see who's going to be in this conversation. Oh my gosh. Wow, I have a lot of people to choose from. Let's see. Sarah. Hello, Sarah. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Sarah. Uh, okay, Sarah. Imagine that you are going to invite everybody, the whole group, for dinner to your house. Okay. 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 Tell me, Sarah. Yes. What, what would you prepare for us? What do you prepare it? Um, in a uh, much and eat no on a uh, uh, chips. I prepare chips? a chips for dinner. I'm going for dinner, man. I, I eat a lot. <laughs> it uh, um, um, prepare a uh, chicken. Chicken. Prepare. 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 Okay. prepare a chicken. chicken. Okay. How would you prepare the chicken? Roast? A soup? How? 
uh, with with pot with potatoes. Okay, perfect, excellent. Oh no, please don't show that to me, Elwin. <laughs> And we show the food that I don't like. And the ones who were with me before know that I don't like that. Yeah, I don't like Really? That. You don't like the pupusas? No way. I don't. Yeah, Urania is Interesting. not in the And we show me the big picture. And uh, it's, not, it's not for me. So let's see. Thank you, Sarah. Let's see, Carlos, Mr. Carlos Salaya. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Tell me, Carlos, uh, what's your favorite food? Las pupusas, teacher. Oh, man. No more questions for you, Carlos. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Tell me, Carlos, which are your favorite ones? Which favorite ones? Um, Mix, cheese, beans and cheese. How do you like them? Cheese. Okay. It's perfect. I prefer cheese. Excellent. If, thank you very much, Carlos. If you know, okay, I am making a small conversation with you and I'm using WH questions. What do you like? How? Why? Okay. Let's see, Carol. Carol is being very quiet. Carol. Hi, teacher. Tell me, Carol, what's your favorite type of music? Uh, favorite what? Type of music. Uh, uh, music, I, I like music, uh, ochentas. What? Roman uh, uh, Romantic. Romantic, yes. Okay, I like romantic I like it. music. I, romantic music, yes. Okay, perfect. Tell me why. Why um, do you like romantic music? Because um, eh, tiene más sentido letra. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Listen, I asked why, and if you remember in the explanation, I told you, if somebody asks you why, you answer because. And she said, because they make more sense to me. That's what she told me. Because they make more sense to me. Look in the chat. Yes, because okay. they make more sense to me. Yes. Okay, and she's saying, ella está diciendo, porque tienen más sentido para mí. Thank you very much, Carol. Mr. Miguel Piensa. Hello, Miguel. Hi, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you quite clear. Tell me, Miguel. Uh, can you hear? Yes, I can. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Okay, perfect. Tell me, Miguel, where do you like to go for vacation? I like me go to the vacation and the beach. Okay, you like to go to the beach. Tell me, which is your favorite beach in El Salvador? Um, El Sunsal. Okay, remember, you have to give me long answer. My oh, favorite okay. beach I, is? My favorite beach is El Sunsal. Okay, why? Why do you like El Sunsal? Tell me. Because uh, it's a beach, um, um, beautiful. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Now let's okay. see the last person of the day. Who is it going to be? El último del día. Who wants to be? Who wants to be? Who wants to be? Let's see. Let's see. Uh, Aura. Aura has been quiet today. Hi. Good, good evening. Hi, Aura. <laughs> Good evening. Guys, you are almost scare me. Tell me, Aura, where do you like to go for vacation? Uh, Aura. 
you need to activate your microphone. Hi. Okay. Where do you like to go for vacations, Aura? Um, the back, last vacation or the, the future? Where do you usually? ¿A dónde le gusta? Okay. Ah, okay. Okay. Uh, for the vacation, I like to go um the highway to beach the highway. La carretera al, a la playa. How? No, no, no. This Hawaii. name is highway. Highway in okay. the in the in, in La Unión. Oh, really? This this name is is that is is that uh, how That's way. the name. That's the yes. name. Yes. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. It's a beautiful beach. Is the most the most beach in the country? I I swear. The most, <laughs> the most beautiful. Okay. You will yes. give me the name. You will give me the name so I can go visit. Yes. Yes. Uh, the, uh, please do it because. Because you are very, very um, encantado. How do you say? Please, perhaps. Well, I need okay. to see. I need to see. Thank you very much, Sharda. Remember, guys, when I'm asking in simple present, ya para terminar. If I am asking in simple present, remember, I am asking about your habits, routine, or fact. Si les hago una pregunta en presente simple, les estoy preguntando sobre hábitos, hechos y rutinas. ¿Ok? Remember, that's why I ask you, eh, what do you prefer? Eh, why do you like it? Where do you go? ¿Ok? I'm asking about facts, habits, or routine. When they ask you, where do you work? What do you do? They are asking you about facts routines or habits okay is there any question no okay believe it or not time's over guys see you tomorrow have a good night take care bye, bye. 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 bye.